ABC News is deliberately, willfully attempting to conspire with the FBI and the Secret Service to lie about what happened with the snipers. They say that they moved his head above his rifle as if he was startled when shots fired, which is an absolute lie. That is not what happened, and I show very clearly in the clip. They, of course, omit showing that they were firing. They fired their weapon. You can hear it clear as day. They fired their weapon. They said, oh, they were scouting. Because people are all like, they had their sights set. They were scouting for threats. Oh, they just happened to have it pointed directly at the shooter. Oh, he was startled. He looked away. There's a former Navy SEAL who's, who's criticizing the fact that he looked up from his weapon. And it's like, okay, the reason he moved was because he fired and he missed and he had to realign because, well, you could see very clearly in other clips that shooter was moving around. Because, by the way, they haven't told you yet, but a cop climbed up to the roof and the guy pointed his gun at the cop. So he retreated. They haven't told you this yet, but this happened. And so they knew that that guy was there. The people reported to the police that the shooter was there. So they were fully aware for minutes they were. Okay. So of course they have the gun pointing directly at the shooter. But in fact, this guy was the first person who shot. And I showed that in another video. But this, this this ABC video is completely lying. Listen to what they say. What these counter snipers trained to do. But this was the first time in history, mm -hmm. according to a former senior oh, agent, he was startled, a secret that's service he moved. sniper no, killed a would-be assassin. I'm going to show you. But clearly a shot too late. In the moments leading up to see. the deadly shooting, you can see those two counter snipers scanning for threats in their positions on the rooftop behind former President Trump. Their high-powered rifles appear to be pointed in the direction of the gunman's position on an adjacent building overlooking the rally. Because they knew exactly seconds, where he was, because they told him. He's on top of the roof. Don't go over there. The sniper appears moment. Right there. The sniper appears momentary. This is so fake because, first of all, look right here. Did you just hear? They're playing this out of order. Did you hear all those shots? The president's still standing. So you know what that means? This part right here is before he was hit and before he went down. And did you not just hear several shots fired? By the time several shots were fired, he was down. So that tells you... ABC is playing this out of order because they're giving a false narrative. What happened was he shot first and simultaneously the other guy was shooting. And there are very, very distinct different sounds between the guns. First, he's using a different gun and different ammo. The sounds are so different. The shot coming from the shooter is... is it just, you could hear the crack, and it's different. And the distance between the thump and the crack that you hear is a dis, is the, the closeness between them is different than theirs. And that's because of the distance of him, which you're going to hear it closer together than the other guy. Okay. And it's just different rounds being used. Also has a different sound, and if you listen closely, you can hear two different guns, gunfires. Okay, but this guy shot first, and I'm about to prove that to you. But again, as I just said, what you heard was you heard several shots, and then they zoom in on him, and and then they're acting like his reaction is responding to what you just heard. But notice he's still standing. And he jumped down. As soon as they shot, that guy was shooting almost simultaneously. And then he was he was hit 
right? And so this is before all those rounds you just heard. So let me play that for you again. On the roof, don't go over there. The One shot. Appears momentarily Shocked. Now listen, l let me show you. Now what you're going to hear is Trump talking. You're going to hear, you're going to see him shooting his gun. He moves. And this is at the point where they say, oh, he appeared startled. So he, 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 he looked up from, no, he was realigning because he missed the shot. And in fairness, the guy was up on the roof moving around because he knows he had been sighted. They were calling the guy out. A cop even approached him and he pointed a gun at the cop, forcing him to retreat. Shots in. Listen. While Trump is talking. Did you see that? Trump is talking. You hear and see him shooting. Trump is talking. Trump is talking. Now watch closely. That guy shot his gun. He's the first one that shot. He missed it. Meanwhile, while he's realigning, tr that is when the, the shooter was able to shoot off some rounds. Take a look what happens. See? You see that? He shot They're his shooting. gun. They're gun. While right. Trump is talking. Take a look what happens. See, he looked up. He is shooting. He is shooting because while Trump is talking. They are deliberately and willfully trying to hide the fact that they failed to get Trump off the stage. They were told. It's widely known across the internet now that they were told there's a shooter on the roof. There's a shooter on the roof. There's a shooter on the roof. And minutes went by. They had their sights on him. They were just scouring looking around. So what you hear that they're playing here where people were shouting, there's a gun, there's a gun. There's sh you hear several things. You hear several shots being shot off and then they zoom in to Trump and then, you know, show the guy as if he's just, you know, as if he's just uh, responding to all of the shooting. And it's so deceptive. He's on top of the roof. Don't go over there. The sniper appears momentarily. He's still standing. By the gunfire. His you see that? Did you hear all them shots? Then they panned to that. As soon as that first shot was fired, Trump went down. So the fact that those several shots were fired, and then they panned to here as if there was that guy's responding to what just happened, and he's still standing, proves these people are liars. And they've got they've got the feds are doing this. They are literally trying to lie. In the thumbnail of this picture, it, they've got the feds. They're behind this. They're totally trying to deny the fact that they deliberately, willfully knew there was a shooter on the roof, did not protect this crowd, did not protect Trump, did not, as soon as this guy told them that there's a shooter on the roof, that is exactly when they should have radioed Warn the crowd, there's an alleged shooter on the roof. Until we can clear and say whether or not there is, you need to get him off the stage. That is the appropriate response that it should have been done immediately. And they just keep trying to deny, mislead, and lie. So again, Trump is talking, he's shooting. That tells you he knows where the shooter is. Trump should have been removed already, and that's the bottom line. Yeah, he was, actually. These guys here shot their gun. What? While he was still talking, okay, the, this gunfire is going on. Take a look what happens. See, see that? He looks up, he shot his gun, and he had to move his gun to realign. Trump is still talking. But this guy, this sniper, is shooting. And of course, they don't want you to know about this guy. Like this guy. You know, that's from the top of the barn. How I'm pointing at that roof. Dare. Just standing there like this. How dare they? And next thing you know, five shots ring out. So your, your son, 
the shots came from that guy on the road. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. And he he was up there for a couple of minutes. He was up you there. You were up there for a couple of minutes. Absolutely. At least three or four minutes. And you were telling yep. the police and the secret service. We were telling the police. We were pointing at him for the secret service. We were looking at us from the top of the barn. They were looking at us the whole time when we were standing by that tree. Did they see Binoculars. Did they see him? Probably not. Because the roof, the way the... So, they did see. They could see. That's why they were able to get the shot that killed him quickly. Although the first one missed, probably because he was up there moving around, because he knew he was sighted again, because guys like him were calling him out. They were all pointing, and cops were walking around, okay? But it's just, it was a failure. They should have immediately said, hey, we've, we've got a potential threat. This is when you say, okay, until it's cleared, Trump, you got to go. Crowd, you know, you need to evacuate immediately or take cover something they failed they need to own it instead they continue to criminally conspire to cover up and lie and who is in charge leading these lies must be removed from power and people need to stand up against these media sources who are lying okay they need to be held accountable so no trump was standing when the first shot was fired clearly by Secret Service. And you, if you listen closely to the different clips, the sound of the bullets are different. There's more of a, more of a ping sound from that crack that comes from the shooter's gun. And theirs are more dull, and, and you can tell that it's closer. There's Two shots clearly heard in close succession, and that is the first shot is by the, the Secret Service sniper, and it was clearly shot while he was still standing. And then you hear that the the it's more of a I wouldn't say high pitch, but more of a ting sound, and you can tell the difference if you listen closely. Okay, you can tell the difference. And just the fact that they they just so try to play people by showing things out of order from which they happened. Like, they show the people screaming, and by the time the clip is done of the people screaming, several shots were fired. Then they pan over to him, who's still standing. Hello, you can clearly see after that first shot was fired, he was down. All those multiple shots, he was already on the ground. So for them to play that clip where there was multiple shots being fired and then pan to him and he's still standing and then try to point at the sniper like, oh, look at what he's doing. As if that happened after all those shots were fired is so obviously misleading. Please do not let them get by with this. I'm begging you to share this and call them out.